Hi guys, this is Melody. Good morning. Hope you're having a beginning of a great week. So, what's in the box? This is episode one of What Are You Stashing? or The Stash Files. Now, I'm not doing this to brag or go, ooh, look at me, I got more stuff than you, or ooh, look at how great I am because I have a box full of goodies or whatever. I really enjoy watching people's hauls and I like to see different products and things that, you know, I probably can't find in my area or I've never seen at any of the crafting stores where I live. So I decided to share with you just random things, um, randomly of what I have in my craft boxes and I hope you guys will enjoy them and just take you know the simple pleasure from seeing cool stuff and I hope you will share what's in your craft boxes with me I know a lot of people do craft room shares I don't have a craft room I have several boxes with stuff and I pull my stuff out and I dump it on the dining room table and that is where I create. Um, I do love craft room tours, but I just thought it would be fun to see what do we keep in those boxes? What do we keep in those storage containers that we're always getting on sale at Michael's and Joanne's or whatever? One real cute thing I want to share you real quick is this Paris sign, and it's wood. I was in Ross last week with my daughter checking out their scrapbook stuff and look $3.99 it's already painted it's even got a little distressing going on and it's just super super cute so I bought that for my daughter for her bedroom okay so what is in the box this particular box is one of those 12 I don't think it's 12 I think it's like 14 by 14 or something like that I got it at um Joanne's when they put their storage boxes on sale and this box is where I keep a lot of my prima goodies and my what's that one the paper studio from Hobby Lobby their version of prima <sighs> okay first of all I am cheap I love a bargain I love Prima goodies. I love the Paper Studio goodies, but I try my darndest not to ever buy it on at full price unless it's just speaking to me. So let's just show you some of the things that I have in here that I haven't used, and I some of it I've used a little bit, but I really got to get better with you know using what's in my Miracle Stash boxes. This is some Resist Canvas. I won't tell you guys where I got all this stuff because half of the time you can't remember and sometimes you get it off of eBay in lot sales or sometimes you get it when someone's selling stuff from their Prima warehouse hauls. This is Spare Parts. I did pick this one up I know for sure from Hobby Lobby because that's Paper Studio product and I just love it and I'm hoarding it. I got it for 40% off and I wanted to buy like every color, but I just couldn't do it. So I had to kind of narrow it down and I ended up just getting this really pretty vintage distressed purple. It kind of looks blue from where I'm standing, but it's more in the purples and the grays. And that little flower there is like a kind of dark tealy charcoal. And this one I think is the natural set. Um, They kind of... Yeah, they call this one neutral. So they do give those names unlike Prima sometimes. And then that's Prima Goodies. It does tell you the collection from there. I hope you can see it. I have to film with my iPhone because I find it just works better. I mean, yeah. That uh, is Joann's. My Joann's in my town didn't have this. In I was somewhere with my daughter for a soccer tournament. And they had a really cool Joann's and Michael's that were huge. And I got it there. That's some Prima Resist canvas. I love that girl. She's just so pretty. These I know for sure I did get from Joann's because, or well, Joann's.com because they were doing one of those weird uh, percentage off of embellishments and this, it ended up being really cheap. 
That's one of my Hobby Lobby clearance bin finds one day. I love this color. I'm hoarding it because I love this color and I don't think I'll ever see it again. So I picked it up and I think that day they only had this pink one and that sea foamy green one. But it's just so pretty. Gotta use it on something. Whatever I use it on, I probably will use it, you know, hopefully for dec decorating or project for myself. Little resin Prima flowers. Some more Prima goodness. And for a while, my AC more was getting uh, Prima flowers in. They really don't seem to get them in anymore. So a lot of times I was buying them with my 40% off weekly coupon that they put in their summer Sunday paper. And guys, if you see me having doubles of something, um, I'm one of those people that if you find it on sale and it's a really good price and, you know, you do the math, I, I do buy doubles that may be considered, I don't know, excessive or something like that. But, you know, when you find the stuff on sale, especially if you're having to do mail order, which is where you I get a lot of my things from, you might as well get it while it's on sale because shipping is so high. And, you know, if you wait till your next payday or your next whatever, it won't be there. Let's be honest. We've all done that, gone back to a store only to be disappointed. I love this purple one. And I just, oh, I just love it. And I like, I really like Prima because their cards are so cute that they package stuff on. And you can make, you know, your smash journals and your junk journals and stuff. This I know I got at Walmart. They had one on the peg. And I've never seen that color again. And they are so darn cute. I'm hoarding them. I'm going to use them. Oh, I got that one as a double. So that obviously was something I purchased on sale. Because, like I said, if you see anything in my stash box and it's a double, it's because it was on sale. This, I know, I got from Tuesday morning. And I have seen someone's video, sorry, I can't remember your name. And they experimented with running little metal tags through their embossing folders. So they only had two. They were 99 cents, so I picked them up. This is a beautiful, beautiful light, sagey green. Really pretty. I don't know if that color will show up. That's Prima. I'm running out of room. Sorry. That's another one of that Prima. That was on sale. I got this on sale, I know for sure, because I've never seen anything like this, and these are leaves. I love these fall colors. Um, I have a Tim Coffee stack. I want to use those on. More Prima. So this box right now is turning out to look like it's mostly Prima, but Prima is some good stuff. That's why it's called Prima, I guess. I like these white ones. They have little iridescent glitter stickle stuff on them. And they're just too pretty. 